Due to their busy travel schedules and the time it takes for teams to properly model courses in their simulation software, drivers often don't try new venues until a week before a race. However, there are currently four grids taking the opportunity to try Miami ahead of Imola, three of which are running in a Red Bull technical simulation at Milton Keynes. I've tried it and I have to say it looks great, Gasly said when Autosport asked him if he was driving around the track in the simulator. I really like this department. Quite a lot of high-speed content, very challenging, unusual types of corners, extremely long corners, very long straights. I think we should have some pretty good American entertainment, good entertainment all weekend, very excited about it, and a unique location. There's a lot of hype over the weekend. Sergio Perez warned that the end of the lap was very tight, with a series of slow corners from turns 11 to 16 leading to the back straight. I think it's a good track, the Mexican said. I think it has a zigzag area, it's hard to find, and visibility is difficult. But I think it will be good to race on all these long straights. I just hope the tarmac is good, and we can race because we'll find some surprises when we get to the new track. Miami Circuit Diagram Photo, Charles Bradley Yuki Junoda also described the final part of the round as an extra challenge. It's really different, especially in the third zone, those corners are too tight, the Japanese said. If there was a safety car, it could be like a real traffic jam there because it's very tight, and even on the hot laps it's still quite a slow curve. So it's going to be fun, and hopefully overtaking will be key on this track. Valtteri Bottas, who raced the Alfa Romeo Sim in Hinwell, also thinks the track should be suitable for racing. Actually, it's nice to see that this seems to be a very good track for overtaking, said the Finn. I think the way the track is planned is positive from my point of view. It should be a good race. Pretty long straights and some really good overtaking opportunities. Let's see how it's done in real life, but to me, it looks good on paper. And I'm sure it's going to be a great event.